How is racism, Nazi Germany, and the caste system in India all interconnected? This is a spoiler-free look at Origin, starring Anjanu Ellis Taylor and John Barenthal. This movie was actually a bit of a surprise. I knew literally nothing going into it. I hadn't seen any trailers or really any marketing material at all for the film. So what is the movie Origin about? Dealing with tremendous personal tragedy and grief, a writer seeks to better understand interpersonal human relationships as she makes global connections about social hierarchy and the caste system. The film deals with very polarizing issues such as class, racism, Nazi Germany, slavery, segregation, and how all of these things connect to the caste system in which certain groups of people put themselves in a higher social position than others. The aim of the film is not to promote a specific ideology or political framework, but rather to show our world history what's been done, why, and how we can possibly do better. There are some really uncomfortable conversations within the film. One conversation discussed is whether slavery or the Jewish concentration camps were worse in terms of number of people killed versus how long it went on. Not exactly a great dinner table conversation. There's interesting points on both sides of the conversation, but you end up realizing that it's all terrible, whether it's subjugating people or exterminating them. The conversations at times are riveting, and at other times it feels like the film is beating you over the head with the themes that it wants to convey. Origin is complex in the way that it jumps from multiple seemingly unconnected storylines to show the interconnectedness of the underlying problem, the caste system. This style of storytelling works to a degree, but at the same time can make you feel like it's a bit all over the place. I feel like the flow of the film worked well overall, but I could see audiences feel like they're being pulled in too many different directions. So it's the character moments that make Origin a really interesting film to watch. The lead character, a real life writer named Isabel Wilkerson, is played brilliantly by Ingenue Ellis Taylor. The amount of personal grief that her character deals with requires a courageous performance from the actress playing her, and I feel like Ellis Taylor more than rises to the occasion. The subject matter in Origin is pretty heavy and will definitely not be everybody's cup of tea, but I do think it is an important film to see. Although the themes and story beats are often spoon fed to us, I do believe that the conclusions and the lessons learned at the end are worth the journey and are important for us to all here. I don't personally think the film ever shifts over to being preachy, but that will vary depending upon the individual. Some of the themes in the movie Origin include that you can't run from trauma, you have to face trauma. Until we are able to deal with the things that have been the most difficult forces in our lives, we can't move forward, grow, and heal. Another theme in the film is that no one has the right to put themselves above others based on their birth. There's a specific line from one of the characters that says no one has the corner on what it means to be a whole person. The themes are interwoven well into the narrative, even if at times they can be a bit overstuffed. There were a few scenes that really struck a chord and drove the message home of how fucked up things can be when people put themselves above others. A particular scene of a boy in a pool was the standout moment for me in the film. I don't want to spoil anything, but the scene perfectly sums up the thesis about how the caste system affects individuals. Origin has a run time of 2 hours and 15 minutes, and it's pretty well paced, but I do think it would have benefited from another editing pass. Some scenes felt redundant in that they were getting across the same message that was already shared in a previous scene. The purpose of the film and the book it's based on is to show the connection between multiple people oppressing other groups of people. There is a 10 minute sequence that is difficult to watch because of the atrocities of what humans are doing to other humans. But the film is PG-13 and I'm glad that it is because it has a greater reach with that rating. And I do think more people should see this film, including young people. So who is this movie for? Origin is an important film for anyone to see, and it is a good reminder that we all share a common trait our humanity. It's not really a grab your popcorn, soda, and candy kind of film, as it deals with difficult subject matter such as racism, concentration camps, and the negative effects of the caste system. I do, however, think Origin is an important film to see because of the conclusions that it draws about oppression, the caste system, and our role as a species. Caste may sound like a boring topic, but this film does a really good job of explaining what it is and the detrimental effects that it has on human beings. Origin is definitely worth seeing in the theater and taking a loved one with you. If you're feeling sexy, my friend, hit subscribe. Check out my Poor Things review here, and I will catch you in the next one.